Right now on Late News Tonight, Sacramento lifting restrictions. The new changes bringing back a little bit of normal. Well, for many people, it's considered the unofficial start to summer. I'm talking about our Memorial Day weekend, and we're also talking about some dangerously hot temperatures. We'll take a look at the opportunity for triple digit highs over the holiday coming up. White House wants churches back open. State leaders say it's not time. We've always known we're essential. A massive spike in speeding on California highways. Law enforcement cracking down on drivers using our roads as a racetrack. In the show, even with the pandemic, Sacramento real estate is booming. Why this brutal recession is bringing back bidding wars. But tonight we begin with those triple digit temperatures heading right into this holiday weekend. Thanks for joining us. I'm Madison Wade and I'm Mike Duffy in for Chris Thomas tonight. Let's get straight to Tracy Humphrey tracking that dangerous heat from home. Hi, Tracy. Well, we do have some very hot temperatures moving into the forecast just in time for the holiday weekend. Temperatures so hot that the National Weather Service has issued an excessive heat watch. Take a look and see how we fared for today. Uh, you know, today was very nice. Temperatures pretty mild and also rather seasonal. 81 in Sacramento, 83 in Fairfield, more 80s down on the northern end of the San Joaquin Valley in Stockton and Modesto. Lower 70s up in the Auburn area, my neck of the woods, and mid 60s in Placerville. Right now outside, looking out toward the Gilmore backyard, it's a very nice evening. Lower to mid 60s through Sacramento, Stockton, Modesto, Marysville, and 36 degrees in Tahoe, just to name a few. For tomorrow, more sunshine and temperatures are warming. We are on the cusp of a warming trend. 89 for the valley, near 80 in the hills and the lower 60s for the Sierra. I mentioned an excessive heat watch. It is for a very good portion of our viewing area. Those hot temperatures expected Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. Coming up, just how hot is it going to get? And what about the cool down? When is it coming? We'll take a look at that with your 10 day forecast coming up. See, new progress tonight on California's roadmap for reopening. 45 of California's 58 counties now have the green light to lift some restrictions. You can see only the Bay Area, parts of Southern California, and rural Tulare County are left out right now. Sacramento rolled out its newly revised stay-at-home order today, and as you can see, people were quick to take advantage of the reopened restaurants. I'll walk you through those new changes in just a minute. But first, growing tensions over whether houses of worship should be allowed to reopen too. Listen. Today I'm identifying houses of worship, churches, synagogues, 